hey guys welcome back or welcome to my channel it's your girl Martha, and i'm here with another video if you're here for the first time welcome to my channel please do hit that subscribe button also you can click the little bell to your right so that you are the first to know each time i upload a new video and if you're a returning subscriber thank you very much you know what to do thank you guys so much for subscribing to my channel thank you for liking thank you for sharing my content and thank you for keeping it locked i know i haven't been consistent with my uploads but you guys keep watching and you, you guys keep subscribing to my channel so thank you guys so much and thank you so much to the new subscribers welcome to my channel as i said earlier and each time i reach a milestone i usually wonder to say how will i get to the next milestone for example if i hit 100 subscribers today i'll think to say how will i get to the other 100 but it's 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 been amazing to see how people have been like subscribing to my channel even though i haven't been you know like posting regularly and that's the other reason i'm here today like i couldn't keep holding on to this video i think my skin has gone through the most of late and like the products that i'm going to share with you have really helped me so before i go on i'll just like to tell you guys to say like skin varies from one person to another so what can work for me won't necessarily work for you or the next person and vice versa i'm also saying this with with, with hair products but i still say to say you can go ahead and try these products there's no harm in trying and if they don't work out then you can proceed and try something else yeah so without wasting any time guys let's roll it <laughs> Yeah, so firstly, I'm going to start with a little background. I noticed my skin started um, getting bad. I think that was 2019. Before then, my skin was okay. Like, I had no issues with my skin. But in 2019, it just ate me because it was too much. I don't know if it's me or everyone else. You guys will agree or disagree with me. I feel like skin is a very sensitive topic. You know what I mean? Like people are really battling problems with their skin i've been there and i know how it feels like my skin these two things my skin and my hair these things have made me cry like my hair when i go to the hairdresser and i don't like the hair so guys like i would legit cry and that's the same with my skin yeah like there are times whereby like i'll just break down and cry like i'll feel dirty like you know like there's just some things with your face the way the pimples come like guys i really had those bad pimples the big ones i usually call them light bulbs because they are just there like this one here like i don't know where this guy came from but we're going to ignore him or her for now like for me i would feel dirty to say like maybe there's something i'm not doing right me i'm not bathing you know what i mean i don't know if it's the same as you guys but personally i associated that with being dirty so from 2019 my skin was very bad and i started using this product called peep off a friend of mine Tango, told me about peep off and um, protex i think that's deep cleanse it's white with some like rough what can i call them like particles like that yeah so that's the one that i was using so she advised peep off and protex so i was using it for quite some time i didn't really see that much change maybe it was because my face was so bad but i tried it and i felt it didn't work out so then i i stopped using people obviously it worked for tango but it didn't work for me as i said earlier skin varies yeah so i moved on to mickey there's this tube mickey i'll put it on the screen if i find it my sister in law used to use it and her face became like her face improved so in my mind i was like okay let me try mickey as well maybe my skin is going to improve but guys like my skin did not improve you know what i mean my skin didn't improve and mickey was kind of a lightening cream it was a bit lightening so my skin began to like to become light lighter than usual and the black spots the pigmentations were really visible because my skin was light and then the dark spots were just there so i was like you know what i think like i'm done i'm completely done with this and i just i think I don't know i don't even remember what i started using if not everyone the the everyone even tone i forget but i don't remember what i started using after that i just used to use normal soap if there's deto at home that day i'll use deto if there's protex i'll use protex but it was alternating between protex and deto because i don't know people say deto and protex are good but they didn't work for me obviously fast forward to end of uh this to end of 2019 that was december i had a friend's wedding 
in Lusaka. So I traveled to Lusaka and this was the state of my face during that period, yeah. So after the wedding, everything went on well and then my face just became like, it just became so bad guys, like I couldn't even, I had enough of my face and that was the time like Porsche M products just came on the scene and Porsche M is a product in uh, that's made in South Africa but then they had um, an outlet here in Lusaka by Kulima Tower. I think they are still there if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, so I decided to hop on to that. I'll put the, the pictures here so that you guys can see. I just forget their names. Yeah, the products worked for as long as they could. So I'll insert a picture of before and after. I think this was um, a, a week or two after using the products. Personally, I would say they worked, like they did their part. I think I used Porsche M products up until uh, end of yeah, yeah yeah i think i used Porsche m products up until the end of last two two years ago that's 2020 december yeah if i'm not mistaken anyway fast forward to today i saw this page on instagram yeah i then don't remember how i started following skin zm there's this page skin zm and they have these facial products and those are the facial products that i'm going to show you guys today as you've seen from it from the title you already know what products um this video is going to is going to be all about yeah so uh last year and ironically like today the 12th of march is the same day that i started using these products yeah this is the day that my products arrived and i was just thinking about it this morning to say this is the day i'm going to do my uh skincare video and when i look at the date it was like 12th march and then i remember to say last year today that's when i started using these products so in other words, it's been a year since I've been using Skin ZM products and guys, they really worked for me. I love how these products have real reviews, real people, real Zambians that have melanin like me. So I, I was very excited to try these products. At first, I was so skeptical guys because if you go on the skincare ZM pages, there are people who battled like worse skin than mine like their skin was so bad some people their skin was covered in acne but you could see the results and that's what pushed me towards skincare zm i was like okay let me give them a try if it doesn't work out we'll try something else and here we are today a year later so yeah I'll, I'll walk you guys through my skincare routine this is my everyday skincare routine this is what i have been doing from 12th march 2021 to today 12th march 2022 so i'm going to run you guys through the products what i use and how i actually do my face each and every day yeah so let's go let's go yeah so this is my face today i'm just using direct um what natural light yeah so this is my skin oh let me show you guys my hair i know it's a related content but hair care skin care why not yeah so guys i'll show you guys what i do every morning and every evening for my skincare yeah so firstly i'm going to start with this glam and glory so this Glam and Glory Cucumber Scrub, I bought this last year, April. So I've been using this since last year, April, and it's like, I think it's here now. I use it as an exfoliator. I use it to exfoliate my skin. And if I'm not mistaken, if I'm not mistaken, exfoliating shouldn't be done every day. It should be done, I think, is it once or twice a week? But for me, I prefer to do it once a week because I feel your face shouldn't go through the most guys like you should exfoliate but you need to be gentle with your skin yeah so i'm going to start with this and then you know the rest will follow shortly yeah so let me just figure out where to put you guys because i don't have a tripod so that we can you know get the ball rolling Now that I've wet my face, it looks something like this. And then I'll go in with the Glam and Glory uh, Cucumber Scrub. I'll just put like a generous amount there. And then I'll start to scrub my face. So guys, you need to be gentle. I 
And guys, you know what I've learned? Like something I've learned about pimples. Like just leave them alone. Just ignore them. I used to be one to like pop pimples, but now I know better. Like just ignore pimples. Like just leave them alone. Just let them do their thing. You know what I mean? scrubbing my face or exfoliating my skin now i'm going to go in with the kapaya gloss off so this is the one that i'm using i usually buy the mini this is the the mini kapaya gloss off that i'm using and one thing i like about it i don't know if you can see it's a bit thickish not super thick it's just you know like it's there okay it's not watery yeah let me show you so what i like to do is i put Yeah. Then, while my face is still dumb, I'll work in circles. Like, circles is the key. Like, you have to work in circles. Yeah? Like, be generous, guys. Like, don't be stingy with your products. That's why your hair doesn't grow. You're too stingy. <laughs> Mind you. Like, yeah, just be generous with your products. Yeah? So what I like to do is, oh my hands dry, I like to work in circles. Man, against my intentions, I let you I'm count up to 60, but bring the person that I am, I count up to 70, like to put a cambacera. Yeah? touch my skin right now like it's smooth like it's as smooth as a baby's bottom right now yeah so let me wash that out quickly off camera and i'll be right back yeah a few moments later so guys i'm back with an exfoliated skin with a cleansed skin and these two right here like did the trick so i exfoliated with the cucumber scrub and I cleansed with the Kapaya Gloss Oil. Now, moving on to moisturizing. So before that, let me pop my face dry. Don't, don't do that. Just be gentle, guys. Like, pat your face dry. Be gentle. Yeah. So just be gentle with your face cloth. And yeah. Mm, if no one tells you stuff if people don't put you on like i'm your girl i'm your plug and whatever that i find is working for me i promise to always share with you guys yeah so i think my face is dry um you shouldn't wait for your face to be like super dry it has to be at least moist don't let it be dry before you moisturize yeah so moving on to my moisturizer i have uh, the skin face and this is the second bottle that I'm bottle. This is the second container that I'm getting. So I'm going to moisturize my face with the skin. I actually have two moisturizers. I use the skin and I use clear essence. Yeah, and I'll explain to you shortly. So I have um, the clear essence and the skin. Now, for the clear essence, I use it during the day because it has like um, what do you call this? it has sunscreen in it that's why i love to use it during the day because you know sunscreen protects us from uv rays and the sunlight and all that like things that can damage our skin so that's why i love to use this one during the day and in the evening i love to use the skin for my evening routine yeah so the face has uh vitamin e vitamin c jojoba oil jojoba oil is also good for your hair turmeric oil and carrot oil yeah so it's white in color and 
again guys like be generous with your products especially if you're going to bed because i hear um skin products work well in the evening my mom always says that we don't know how true that is but <laughs> mama is always right yeah so we just Yeah, so after that is done, I go in with my Gentle Magic Serum. But yeah, I ran out and I bought this one today. So you pop that open and then... So this is more like my night routine. If it was during the day, I would have used uh, Clear Essence instead of the face. But every other product remains the same. The only thing that I change is the clear essence if it's during the day and the face in the evening. Okay, I also cut up for the neck, but because <clears throat> like I already taken my bath, I'll just focus on the face, you know what I mean? But on a normal day, I'll usually do my my neck as well because we want this part to be glowing and then this part to be looking as if it's the back of the tree. <laughs> yeah. Huh. And then, last but not the least, I introduced this vitamin C to my skincare routine in uh, December. I'm actually running out. I'm not sure if we're going to get some. I think I've managed to get some on my face, as you can see. Yeah, so I'm just going to wrap that in. Also guys, like be consistent. It doesn't matter what products you are using. Consistency is key. I'm always saying this when it comes to my hair, like consistency is key. You have to be consistent in everything that you do. Not only face, not only hair, but you know, business, job, relationships. <laughs> be consistent. Before I go guys, I just wanted to say, my skin is not perfect. It's not the perfect skin you would see, but for me, it's perfect. Because if I show you, I'm sure you've seen from the photos guys, like I've come, a long way with my skin and getting to this point has been a lot of hard work a lot of tears and a lot of consistency i usually have pimples yeah like that i mean i'm using these skin products then i don't have pimples i usually have like pimples pimples but not the bad ones that i had so all in all i'll give these products a 10 out of 10 i do not fault them in any way their consistency is perfect it's not so watery as i mentioned earlier thank you guys so much for watching we've come to the end of this video hope you loved it if you did don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and please try to check out the skin zm page so that you can check out their products obviously they have a wide range of products they don't only sell their products i think they also have like nivea products um palmas and um they also have like scrubs so if you want to exfoliate your skin you can either buy the glam and glory cucumber or you can check out their scrubs and also um their soaps don't only work for the face you can also use them for for your body if people actually use them for their body their stretch marks you know what guys just go check out the page let me not give out everything because then if i say everything you feel lazy to go check out the page at least i've, I've i think i've come through yeah so thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and i will see you guys next time bye